Should you take the CompTIA Security Plus SYO-401 or the SYO-501? If you did not know, CompTIA is about to drop a brand new Security Plus exam. What? In this video, we're gonna talk about it. And then we're gonna talk about the latest that CompTIA has going on with Security Plus as a whole. And then we're also gonna do a giveaway. Stay tuned, watch the full video, and I can show you how you can get this book that's actually the top Security Plus book right now for free. Y'all keep getting all these messages in my phone. What is going on? First of all, B, why the heck you got a flip phone? Second of all, you might be getting blue jack. Hey, what's good, YouTube? I'm Dewan. On October 25th, 2017, CompTIA will be releasing the SYO-501 Security Plus exam. This is a brand new exam that's full of all new material and information. And honestly, there's not much information on the exam yet because it has not been released. I'm sure it's gonna cover bring your own device because that's huge in security right now. There's so many different areas because security is the number one topic right now in IT. So if you are working on your SYO-401 exam, there's some things you should know. The actual exam does not expire until July 2018. So if you're in 2017 and you've been studying for your SYO-401 exam, I would say continue pushing on. But if you are thinking about getting your Security Plus exam, the thing you should think about is the SYL-501 does not have much material or information about the exam online yet. So you're gonna kinda go in this exam blindly, so you may wanna kinda wait or go for the 401 exam. But the difference between the two, you could run into an employer that says, hey, we need you to have the latest Security Plus exam um, certification. So that could be one hang up, but I doubt you run into that, but that's just something to keep in mind. One more thing to keep in mind, if you do decide to get the SYO 501 exam, you will be more likely to be prepared for the security field in 2018. Either way, I think you're in a great position getting a Security Plus certification. Now, I know a lot of my subscribers are in the networking field or looking to get in the networking field. The Security Plus exam will work wonders, whether you're on the help desk side, you're on the knock side, the network side, infrastructure side, it does not matter. Now let's talk about this CompTIA Security Plus exam book by Darrell Gibson. This book has four and a half stars on Amazon and it has about 820 reviews. I think it's the top book for the Security Plus. All you gotta do, subscribe, like, comment, and this book can be yours. Now let's talk about all of you that may be watching this video in 2018. The CompTIA Security Plus SYO-401 exam does expire July of 2018. So if you plan on taking that exam, I would give yourself about a four month cushion. Now people may say, hey, that's a lot of time. That's too much time. You only need a couple weeks, but life happens. So God forbid you walk into that exam and you do not pass and you only took a month or two months and you don't have enough time to retake, then you just study an exam for no reason. So I would say give yourself about a four month cushion to go in there and knock the SYO-401 exam out before it expires. That's just my two cents. You can take it how you want it. I wish you success regardless. Now let's talk about the latest that CompTIA has going on in security. And for that, we're gonna get on my computer. So we're on CompTIA's website and we're looking at their newsletter from September 27, 2017. I highly recommend if you are in the security field, if you're looking to get your Security Plus, you sign up for CompTIA's newsletter so you can stay up to date what they have going on because they really have big things going on in the CompTIA space. This newsletter lets you know how to get into cybersecurity. They talk about the Security Plus exam, and then they also talk about some exams that I, that I didn't even know they had, but I guess they're trying to expand outside of just the Security Plus into some other certifications like one of the certifications that CompTIA is offering now is the CompTIA Cybersecurity Analyst Certification it's called the CSA Plus and then they're also offering the CompTIA 
Advanced Security Practitioner, the CASP certification. So if you're looking to be a pen tester, CompTIA is offering that now. If you're looking to get in the field to be a security analyst, a cybersecurity analyst, CompTIA is offering that now. So these are more certs that you can stockpile in your resume, your LinkedIn profile, to let these recruiters and these companies know that you're serious about security. Let me in. <laughs> you know, so they also talk about the release of the latest certification for the Security Plus, which is the SYO-501. I'll leave a link in the description for this article. If you all are interested, please go check it out. Sign up for the newsletter so you can stay up to date on the latest security information coming from CompTIA. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Keep pushing, keep putting in the work, and as always, keep believing in yourself, family. I'm Dewan, and I'm out. Peace.